88, Bros were the big band that everyone sort of remembers. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, a big hand for our Brother Beyond! Woo! Yeah! Brother Beyond and Bros, they're kind of in the same small gum poppy area. And uh, I think if you were a young kid at the time, it was almost you had to make a choice between being a Brosette or a Yondu. <laughs> We heard of Brother Beyond through the school actually. Um, Sign Manning in Labrick Grove, which was my um, secondary school, were asked to appear in their video. And um, it was there that we fell in love. <laughs> as soon as the band came out, you know, it was like, oh God, who's that gorgeous thing, you know, in the white pants? So um, went straight down to the front, front row, and that's where I stayed for the whole duration of the video. Why can't you see I'm only desire to be famous when you're, you're a young boy. If you join a band, you know, that's what you want to do. You want to you feel what it feels like to be famous. Well, we've got some fabulous live acts in the studio tonight, I'll tell you. We'll go back to number 24. It's a clamber of 10 places. Here they are, Brother Beyond with the harder I try. The harder I try happened kind of very quickly. It was out one week, and then we were sort of asked to do Top of the Pops, which is, you know, it's a, it's a boyhood dream, really, to do that. I remember walking down um, Oxford Street one day, and I really felt the sort of everyone's eyes upon me and I really felt for the first time I thought god this is this is what it's like to be famous Nathan was like this little sexy flirt I was 16 at the time and you know, he'd be like oh, it is, like, show us your it'd be like ooh he's just cheeky you know cheeky little sod that's why we liked them, because they were just, you know, that's a normal thing that a, a bloke would say to a girl. Well, not necessarily a 16-year-old, but there you go. Nathan's dancing it, because he'd do this, or he'd go like that, a lot like he was standing out of fire, because he was one of those boys who couldn't dance properly, yet gave it a really good shot. When you compared Nathan to Matt, there was just... No comparison. It's like stamping out a fire, just looking really cool. Brother Beyond was based on Motown. That was our thing. Bros were based on the Hitler Youth, basically. Brother Beyond got to number two with The Harder I Try. <laughs> they tried a little too hard for those devoted Bros babes. Sharpen coins. And when we do the junior best disco at town, things like that, they'd just throw them at the stage. I mean, they were like hardcore. <laughs> It's a lot of baggage to carry around with you, and I think Matt and Luke uh, have had to carry that for the last 10 years, you know? And very often when you think of Ross, you think of allowing lots of money and a lot of silliness. Well, I think that with Brother Beyond, people sort of quite affectionately remember, oh, that, that nice record, The Harder I Cheer. Oh, yeah, I like that. And um, I think that's the way I kind of like it to be, you know? Somewhere in history, but not too indelibly printed. Answer.